Turning now to Money Monday and how to set yourself up to be in the strongest possible financial position even during these volatile and unstable times. And look at who we got in the building today. Going to break down how we can build a cash cushion. We got financial expert, New York Times bestselling author and host of Money Rehab podcast, Nicole Lappin, a friend of our show. Here, actually. Money rehab? Yeah, well, we could all use Always. some money rehab, but good Always. to have you here in the building Thank with you. us. Um, we've been you know what's better than Zoom? It is. It's, it's IRL. IRL. It's <laughs> old school. No URL. Uh, IRL. <laughs> it is so good to have you in the building, but we've been seeing all this news and we hear interest rates going up, which is supposed to be a bad thing in some situations, but you can tell folks why this is also will be a good thing. Guys, recessions are amazing times when great fortunes can actually be made if you lean into financial literacy and you have some cash on the sidelines. So yeah, it stinks for folks that have debt when you see higher interest rates. So credit card debt, if you're getting into debt, mortgages, car loans, business loans, any kind of loans. But on the flip side, it's great for savers. So what have we seen at the bank for the last decade, right? Diddly squat yep. as interest. That's going to change. So we're going to see real returns with savings accounts, CDs, Stuff that's typically boring, now it's going to get some more much-needed interest love. All right, so let's talk about boring bonds. Um, <laughs> they can be, according to experts, uh, I wouldn't know anything about it, they could now be of great value. Explain what bonds mean in this time. I know they're boring, they're not <laughs> sexy, but they're safe yeah. and they're steady. So when you hear that bonds are declining, remember how bonds work. So when the price declines, the interest rate goes up, which we like to see. So right now, the Treasury, the 10-year benchmark Treasury, which are bonds by the government, are above 3%. So this time last year, when I was talking to y'all on Zoom, we were below 1.5%. So that's a serious difference. And you can get bond exposure through your your retirement account through a brokerage account if you have it you could go direct to treasurydirect.gov this is my favorite site this is how I like to have a good time um, <laughs> <laughs> while you're there I also suggest to check out series I bonds uh, series I bonds are awesome right now I standing for inflation this is inflation protecting your money they're at 9.62 percent this is what I get excited about it's it's a big deal inflation is at 8.6 percent and we'll have more numbers uh, coming out this week, uh, but that's that's a big difference. Uh, well, look, that's why we have you here. You can make <laughs> treasury.gov and bonds sound fun. Um, <laughs> I know how to party. <laughs> but uh, index funds as well. You're all about financial literacy, and this is something people need to be up on. It is. I love index funds for the equity portion of your portfolio. So a basic portfolio would be take your age and put it as a percentage for bonds, and then take the rest in stocks or equities. <laughs> the rationale behind that is the older you are, the less risky you are. So bonds have less risk, but also less reward. So y'all would have 21% of bonds and then the rest in equities, of course. And for that portion of it, you guys are aging in reverse. It's unfair. Oh, wow. um, but for the equity portion, <laughs> index funds are an awesome choice right now. Index funds track an index. So what the heck is an index? When you hear on the news, the Dow is up, the Dow is down, the S&P or the NASDAQ is up or down, that's an index. So an index fund for the S&P 500 tracks the whole shebang. So you buy that and you're basically buying a little baby piece of all of those 500 companies. When one goes down, another gets propped up. If one goes really down, gets booted out, gets out of the S&P 500. So it's right. good diversification. And th probably the one that maybe I might understand or be able to get my head around the most is the real estate market. Uh, but you say there's a way to get in on the action. It's obviously very competitive right now without even owning a home. Right? Those open houses. I'm like, are y'all giving something away? Those lines around the block. If you haven't been able to buy a home or you don't want to get into investment properties, like you don't want to deal with tenants, you don't want to deal with their plumbing or whatnot, you can take advantage of the returns of real estate by investing in real estate investment trusts. So REITs, R-E-I-T, uh, you can buy and sell like stocks. So this is great because you don't have to deal with somebody's plumbing, but also they give dividends. Dividends are awesome. They're like little presents that you get based on the number of shares you have. So if you have 10 shares and it gives a dollar of a dividend, you get 10 bucks. And don't then you, you reinvest. Don't you just love her enthusiasm yes. about things that kind of go whoop right over my head? But I love you're making me <laughs> want to get involved. You so. have to. Compound 
interest, baby. All right. <laughs> I, I, I am course. involved, but I just can't look at anything right now because it's really depressing. But now's the time to buy. Yep. Buy low, sell high. There you go. Are we, are we I at the high? That. <laughs> no, we're not. So it's a great buying opportunity. Oh, Nicole, thank you so much for being with us. We love having you here in studio. <laughs> oh, we'll buy anything you're selling. You just have an enthusiasm for it's everything. That's true. <laughs> well, how about buying her I'm book? I'm going to check. Yes. Oh, there book, it is. Miss Independent. It's available everywhere books are sold. There you go. Thanks again, Thanks, Nicole. Good. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.